So moving to the next question. The question is Ravi obtained 70 and 75 marks in the first two unit tests. Find the minimum marks he should get in the third test to have an average of at least 60 marks. So he is getting 70 and 75 marks in the first two tests and we have to find the minimum marks. When in the question if it is minimum or maximum, whether it is marks or grade or whatever it is, we have to apply linear inequality. We have to apply the inequality symbol. Okay, so when you saw the word minimum or maximum, think about linear inequality and it is the equation will be you have to convert the equation into the format of linear inequality. Okay, so here also we will do the same. So the question is to find the minimum marks. So I am taking x as a minimum mark. Okay, and what is the question now? He is getting, the question says about three unit test. First unit test he is scoring 70 marks. In the second one he is scoring 75. And in the third we are taking as x. How we will calculate the minimum or average, not minimum, average of two numbers. If I want to find the average of 10 and 15, what should I do? I should add these two numbers, divide it with the 2. So that if I want to find the average of 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5, there are 5 numbers. How we will find the average? 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5, whole divided by how many numbers are here? 5. So that same way, here the question speaks about 3 marks, 70, 75 and x. And the question, in the question we have to find the minimum mark so that average is 60 marks, average. Okay, so we have to find the average of 3 marks. What is the average of 3 marks? Average of 3 marks will be, what you have to do is sum all the marks divided with the 3. So 70 plus 75 plus x divided by 3. That is the average of all the 3 marks. And what is the condition? We have to find the minimum marks. That means we have to find x so that average is at least 60 marks. At least 60 marks means minimum value is 60. It can be more than 60. Okay, at least 60 means minimum value is 60. For example, for your driving license, for one to appear for a driving license, minimum age is 18 years, isn't it? That means for a person who is having 35 years can also appear for the driving test, isn't it? So what about the case if the person is having only 15 years, can he or she? No. Okay, so minimum means this is the case. If I am taking 18 as the minimum years, more than 18 years can appear for the test. Same way here, the minimum marks is 60. Hmm? Minimum means at least 60 means it is a minimum mark. So more than all the numbers which is more than 60 can be, be the average. So which will be the inequality we have to put the average 70 plus 75 plus x divided by 3 should have an average of at least 60 mark at least 60 that means minimum is 60. So how sh should I write the inequality? Is it greater than or equal to or less than or equal to? Obviously, it is greater than or equal to. Minimum mark is 60. This average can take a value greater than 60. Okay. Again, the rest is the all the same. Just close multiply. So, what we get is 70 plus 75 gives you 145 plus x greater than or equal to 60 into 3 gives you 180. So, that we are getting x greater than or equal to 140. 1 minus 145 plus 180 that is x greater than or equal to 35 180 minus 145 gives you the value 35 so what we are getting is x greater than or equal to 35 come back to the question we have to find the minimum mark so that average is at least 60 we took the condition average is at least 60 and we have to find the minimum mark so here if i get x greater than or equal to 35 the condition is if x is taking a value greater than or equal to 35, the average will be more than or equal to 60. Okay, if x is taking value greater than or that means if Revi is scoring marks greater than or equal to 35, he will be getting an average of 60 marks. And the question is, if he wants to get at least 60 marks, what is the minimum mark? Then can you identify which is the minimum mark required? The minimum mark will be the least of this value. The value x can take is greater than or equal to 35. So the minimum mark required to score 60 percentage, 60 marks as average is 35. Okay, x greater than or equal to 35. That means if Revi is scoring 35 or above for the third test, he will be scoring at least an average of 60 marks. 
the question is we have to find the minimum mark that Ravi should score for the third test so that he gets an average of 60. So the minimum mark Ravi should score is 35. If he gets 36 also he will be having a score of average of 60, plus 60 marks. If he uh, scores 70 marks also then also the average will be more than 60. Okay, and the question is the minimum mark. That is the reason why we are taking the value of x as 35.